Hi guys, this is the second lawnmower of the original three from the Facebook Marketplace. Three for free lawnmowers. This is a Poulon 500. It's 158 cc. Um, you know, it's it's pretty old. It doesn't seem to be probably have a high value to it, but we're gonna go ahead and see if we can get it to run just for fun. So this switch right here won't release. It doesn't move when you pull the cable back. So that's gonna be step one. We can't even get spark until we get this to come back and un unhook from that switch. So we'll start with that. So to better expose that cover or that switch and how it works, we're gonna take the pull start cover assembly off. Now, I removed all the bolts that go to this pull start assembly. And set this to the side. Okay, so we sprayed some WD-40 on it to try to loosen up this. So if you watch the cable, when you pull on the handle, the whole cable's moving. See how it moves and it's not, it's not held in place. You need it to be held tighter if you want it to actually function up there. So what we'll do is we'll run a zip tie to hold this cable in place. Let's see if we can't get it to move by doing that. If you can see that now it's moving back and forth which will turn off and on the coil because it was stuck actually open so from the switch to that lever grounding through there it was stuck in the open position so if we did get it started it wouldn't have shut off and unless you pull the coil from the plug and sometimes you get zapped when you do that not recommended so now we're going to test this that we have that switch moving So we're going to take this fuel tank carburetor assembly off. There's a Allen bolt that holds this part on. That will expose the screws. I already loosened them all up. That's pretty much the carburetor gasket. It's just, it's full of water and fuel. So let's just clean it and get rid of all this water and fuel in here. We have spark. That looks easy enough to clean. So let's clean that up, clean this out, put fuel in it, and see if it's enough to fire it up. So we blew it out. Probably can't see inside of it, but it's all clean now in there. So we'll just clean this up and we'll put it back together and hopefully that'll work. That's what the inside of the fuel tank looked like. We'll put fuel in it, we'll put it back together, we'll see if it starts, if it does, we'll clean it up. If not, we'll make a decision what we're going to do with this one. So here's the thing. We're going to go ahead and put this one on the curb for free. You win some, you lose some. It was one of three of the free lawnmowers and I don't want to just fix it haphazardly. Um, I want it to run good before I even sell it, even if I only sold it for 50 bucks. I'd rather let someone else give it a try that wants to put some money into it. I don't want to put any money into this one. Um, I don't think it's worth the money, so we're going to 